Louis Valois was arrested after one of the team was refused entry to the club because staff thought he'd had too much to drink. Our reporter James Blatch is in Luton now. James, what more do we know? Well, we know that this began really with promotion to the second division for Luton. That happened over the Easter break. The champagne was flowing by the end of the match yesterday and the team, as you might expect, went out to celebrate on the town just behind me in Luton last night. Now, we don't know where they went beforehand, but we do know that about a quarter to 11, about 20 or so players and friends arrived at Liquid Nightclub. And it was here that one of the team, described by the nightclub's owners today uh, as re being refused admission, as he did not meet the admission ruling relating to sobriety. In common speak, the staff thought that he was too drunk to get in. Other members of the group, it was said by the nightclub's owners, uh, took exception to this and a melee ensued, during which uh, staff of the nightclub uh, were said to have been assaulted. The police were called and Jean-Louis Valois was arrested by Luton Police. He spent the night in the cells at Luton Police Station and has spent much of today answering questions. As of now, there have been no charges and he has not been released on bail. They have 24 hours, the police, to make a decision either way on that. James, as you said, Luton has had a good season so far. How will this affect their season? I don't think it's going to hugely affect it. They have clinched promotion. There is a title scrap going on with Plymouth Argyle. Uh, what's interesting is that Valois himself is only on a 12-month contract. He's in a process of deciding whether he's going to stay or go at the end of this season. This may have swayed him to think about going back to France.